Hello, welcome to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Elizabeth and double welcome and my computer is being very slow today so this might be an issue. But um, I, thank you for the feedback I got from the last video about what I should do with like the tents and stuff. I think I'm gonna like go to the tree line over here and hope that helps give me some cover or something. But yeah, she's like Honestly, it, it's not looking good for her at the moment. We did get our miracle, miraculous food and uh, water. That was amazing. I'm, I'll admit, I don't know why that last video did so well. Like, it, I honestly, I don't think it was one of my more interesting videos. It was just kind of, eh. Uh, how do I make her go into the tent? Yes, go into the tent. Okay, good. Um, hopefully she doesn't get attacked. This could be bad. I got my finger on escape, just in case, because I know I'm not going to be able to move fast enough. Anyways. Sorry, it's been a little bit. Oh! Alright, cool. She's okay. Knock on wood. Um... Let me take down that tent and we'll take it. And one of you said the big backpack is supposed to be better because it reduces the weight, the carry weight of things. So I will grab that. But anyways, um, yeah, sorry it's been a little bit. I got invited on an impromptu, well not an impromptu vacation, but like I got invited last minute to the vacation because it's when my stepmom goes on with her mom usually and they had an extra bed at the condo they were going to. So they were like, Elizabeth, do you want to come with us? And I said, sure. So I just went and I was not going to take this. Um, I was not about to take my big old gaming laptop with me. So let's see what she does with the other backpack. This is gonna be like some next level big brain thinking. <laughs> Just put it into the, yeah, great, good. Big backpack. You don't need these. And now she's thirsty, which sucks, but like, girl, you're still doing better than you were yesterday. Honestly, we could just, let me solve this right now. We could put out the pan, let it fill up, and then boil it. And she has water. Clean drinking water. Wait, oh, wait, no. <laughs> I think I just, yeah, I just equipped that. I didn't want to. Oops. Drop. And a notification popped up on my screen. Now it's gone. It's fine. But this week was pretty wild. Okay? Like, let's see if we have anything that makes her happy. The, the trip was fun. However, I did get rejected from not one, but two different jobs, two consecutive days in a row that I applied for. So that sucked. Um, and one of them I've actually really wanted for a long time, so that extra hurt my pride. But I had a backup plan for things I wanted to apply to in case that didn't work. So, how do I like, I want to take things out of it. There we go. Anyways. Yeah, I had a plan to apply for different things, so I applied to this other program I've been interested in. Not as much as the other one, but still, like, it would be cool if it worked out, um, which I needed to get two references for. So, I messaged a bunch of my professors and, like, academic advisors and stuff from college, because this was very last minute. And, like, the deadline is a couple hours from now when I'm recording this, and I just turned it in. <laughs> 
And um, two of them, actually three of them, came through and like got me, like wrote me references and stuff. And one of them, he was like, oh yeah, yeah, like, if you're interested in doing that, you should go work for this company in this country. I happen to be bored of like the chair of that company, the president. Just saying. <laughs> so that's the story of how I uh, fell into that situation not too long ago. So, yeah. Yeah. Other than that, it's been pretty normal. Still working on my book, if you watched the last video. And maybe we go ahead and grab these. Oh, empty mug, leave it out. Uh, sure, burn this lumberjack shirt. I hope it's not one we're using. Let's hope it doesn't go out. We need to... There we go. Boil that water. I hope this doesn't explode. We'll just... That sounds really weird, by the way. That fire. I don't know if it... Oh, that scared me. It sounded like something went... <sighs> Anyways. I would like my water, please. Also, don't... No! Okay, let me strip down these corpses. And we'll, we'll keep this fire going. Which, arguably doing it in the rain, not great. But that's what we have to work with, okay? Ines doesn't have a ton of options available to her at the moment. I should probably go ahead and add fuel to this too. And make sure she's equipped the axe in both hands. Uh, I don't know. Can you equip it in both hands or just one? I guess just one. Grab all their clothes and use them for fuel. Ah, okay. These aren't tainted anymore. Yay! And now we don't have to worry about doing anything with the... all that. Uh, pour into the empty bottle, I guess. Why can't I drink this? Uh, well, her her little thing went away, so... Whatever. We're not gonna worry about it. It's not a problem anymore. Oh, she's hungry. Wham, wham, wham. Have some beer. <laughs> uh, I guess eat the chips. We still- we need a lot more food. Well, we need more food. And we probably need to find a place to hole up where we can rest and stuff. Although we have the tent now. That would be a fun challenge. Only being able to sleep in the tent. Be both scary and, and amusing. Maybe I'll try that in the future. I don't know. Yeah, let's go find... Somewhere for her to stay. I don't know where we are. We still haven't looked at our map. If you're curious. So we're still very, very lost. Maybe I like... I don't know. So maybe I should drop that on the ground and get more water, but... Nah, it's fine. I'm just gonna walk down the road. Walk. Walk. Oh, yeah, the 
the professor who said, who's like now the president of that corporation, because he retired from my, our college to go do that in a different country, um, like as a volunteer kind of. He apparently met my aunt at church. They go to the same church, so he just mentioned that in a call when he asked me for some of my information for the application <laughs> for the reference letter. So that was interesting. And he's like, oh yeah, and this is your grandma, right? And I said, yes, it is. So if you're like, wow, that's concerning, it's not that bad. Um, I, I went to college in a very small town, so I also grew up in this very small town. So everyone kind of knows everyone, at least a little bit. Yeah, she's severely depressed, but she's alive. You could give her beer. And that might actually raise her fun. It lowers her unhappiness. Go ahead and drink a beer. Just walking in the rain with a cold one. Now we're just depressed and we're we're satiated. There you go. Man, I wish I knew where we were going. There's some blood on the ground. Don't know why. I'm thinking of the intro song to Golden Kemboy now. That was a pretty good anime that I watched recently. Side notes, too, now that I'm talking about music. <laughs> if you saw it, I made a Christmas video trying out a Christmas mod in this game for 2020, Christmas 2020. And in that video, if you saw it, you might recall that I said, I hope this doesn't get copyright striked. But you know what? It doesn't matter, because this channel is not big enough. Okay, so my computer decided to crap out and not to record the screen. So just so you know the clip I'm talking about. I was going to say, you know what? I hope that's not copyrighted. But do you also know what? It doesn't matter because this channel is not big enough for that to be a problem. And it was a problem. Also, I've been meaning to show you guys this. This is my automatic shutoff feature on my laptop. I um, hope I got it in there. Yeah, very advanced um, modification I've made on my computer. You know what happened? Someone copyright claimed it, <laughs> which I don't know if it was like a bot or something. I don't know. But either way, it was kind of pointless because at the time of making this video, I've only got like 160 subscribers. So no, I'm definitely not making any money from this. So neither was whoever claimed that. Probably because of all the Christmas music. But, you know, I made it private because I'm salty. <laughs> yeah, that happens. What if you can get hit by lightning in this game? That'd be interesting. Kind of depressing. Ooh, I, I just realized we haven't had the helicopter event. Okay, it's only been three days. We're, we would be massively unlucky if that just happened. Knock on wood. You're drowsy, eh? Well, well, well. We have a tent. Oh, okay. I didn't mean to like walk into that tree and completely block our view. But we did. And it's fine. We'll just set up. Oh wait, I gotta... Do, do. Are you doing it? Oh, okay, she had to get it out. I'm sorry. 
Probably could have put it, yeah, a little further back. Oh well. He like arrested it. I don't particularly want you to go to sleep yet because then you're gonna wake up in like the middle of the night and be like, I can't sleep. Ooh, take a shower in the rain. <laughs> it's saying you could take a, I didn't realize that you could take a drink from a puddle on the ground. Which probably isn't very sanitary or safe. They're, they're right on that one. Oh, oh shoot. Oh, I do not like this. Oh, it's so dark. Can you please just like go into your tent? Oh, I can't see anything. And it's the middle of the night. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, we'll wait until she gets tired and then we'll make her go to sleep again. Oh gosh, okay, hope nothing comes up. Eh, I guess you could like forage for stuff. Maybe some of that? Sure, why not? Just in the middle of the night. Unpleasantly hot. What's unpleasantly dark? And I keep hearing like... Pool balls clacking. <laughs> I don't know who's playing pool out here. But it's noisy, okay? Oh gosh. I thought I heard something. So you know what I do? I don't look at it. Okay, thank goodness. I can see now. Like, at least a little bit. That's- that's all I need. Is like, just a little bit, and we'll be okay. I mean, will it suck? Kind of, because... It's still really hard to see. But now it's not impossible to see, which is a big difference. Okay, are you guys hearing that too? Just like the clacker balls, or not clacker balls. That's like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure type stuff. The pool balls, like pool cues and billiard balls, I think they're called. The ones with like the numbers on them and they're colored. That's what that sounds like. Unknown berry. Maybe we don't eat that. Eat the worm. Yum yum. It's like the dirt version of sushi. Which is just raw bugs <laughs> or insects or whatever. How many of these do we have? We have three? Can I eat one? I don't know. That makes me kind of nervous. We'll wait until absolutely necessary to test that out. So we still have like tuna and beer, so... What else do you need, am I right? My fingers are starting to hurt from pressing on the keys. There we go. Think smarter, not harder. Is it just me or does it look like she's like limping? Well, she's fine. We're kind of midway strong. That's kind of cool. Is that good or not? I don't know. We got like one bar and short blunt. We have a little boost to first aid and metal working. With no way to metal work, so. It's super useful, I guess. Got some places that are not protected at all. Need to work on that. 
she's getting hungry. I'm gonna wait a little bit because we only have ooh, a fork in the road. Okay, I think we go this way. I think that's the play, guys. Okay. What waits for us down this road? Very poetic. Anyways, I was saying something and now I forgot. Yeah, yeah. We have only berries, the mystery berries, so we don't know if they're safe to eat or not. And, um, tuna and beer. And apparently that thing that just at us somewhere in the forest. Okay, well, maybe we have her eat the tuna. Oh, she did it real quick. Sure, go ahead and eat your tuna. And then litter. Because no one's alive to care. It's just us. Unless I get on Daisy, like one of you guys suggested, with my dad. Which, by the way, good idea. However, it is very hard to get my dad to play games. <laughs> he likes games. He avoids playing them because I think because like he knows he'll get way too into it and then he it'll be hard for him to stop playing. So that's why he avoids uh, getting into games that he really likes. I think anyways. He does have a Minecraft server with some of our family members, which is cute because my little cousin plays on it too. He's like 10 and he thought my house was really cool in that server. So I said, okay, you can move in because he didn't have a house. And he is like, yay. And he told me the other night when we visited them during our vacation, he said he was gonna move out. So I said, all right, you're moving out. Spread like, just, all right, good, good for you. I was gonna say spread your wings and fly, but I didn't say that in person. I don't remember what I said in person, anyways. Yeah, he was like, I'm moving out, so. <laughs> I'm an empty nester in Minecraft. Soon. We'll see if he actually does it. This is gonna be another video where I just cut out a whole lot of walking. Whoa, that's a lot of blood. They, they really enjoyed just like putting out random blood splatters out into the world. The developers, I assume. Just for fun. She really looks like she's limping, but it says she's not. I'm trying to think. I think we started in Moldra. <sighs> Moldra is near the middle, I think. And then Rosewood's all the way at the bottom. Then there's like, no, is Muldra to the, completely to the side of the map? It's probably gonna be reversed whichever way I post this because of how my camera's recording on my phone, but I don't know. I don't know where we're going. Maybe just out into nature again. Just us and a couple cans of beer. And some mystery berries. That's all we have to eat now. I really need to end this soon because it's already like 30 min 1 minutes long. If you've watched any of my other videos, we know that the longer the videos get, the harder it is for my internet to handle uploading the face footage mainly. Um, is the problem. So, oh, more blood. Anyways, I hope we find something. Something exciting that doesn't get us killed. That'd be cool. I feel like I'm getting a sense of deja vu though, rounding this corner. I feel like it's because of the serp Herb Survivor's mod when I tried that. I feel like I went up a road like this. I guess not though, because there's nothing here. 
And the one I went on in that one had like other little tiny roads going off of it. I'm probably just like walking out to the edge of the map. We'll see like some roadblock or something. Man, and this would have like some toned calves. Or like just legs in general from all this walking she's doing. Like just miles. Miles and miles and miles of walking. Although she doesn't have like any food, so maybe not that toned. But like if we ever need to kick someone. And we did have food. Oh my gosh, I just made the camera move, sorry. Um they would cry for help. <laughs> I really think about my trash talk for a second because I don't normally trash talk. I should look at a map. I should, but I'm not gonna. Not yet. It'd be really cool if we came across some cars though. That'd be nice. One that worked would be nice with a key and gas. That's the life. I don't know if I've talked about this before. My car in real life, right now, uh, on the driver's side door. I don't know why this happened, but the like piece of plastic uh, next to the handle where you like can open and close it from inside, it popped off. So sometimes it falls onto the ground when I open the door now, and I have to like make sure I pick it up and like try to shove it back on because it won't snap back fully. I've tried and my dad has tried too. So it's kind of just like this fun little mystery compartment in the side of my door now, or in my door now. <laughs> I wouldn't put anything in there though because chances of getting it back would not be good. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. I don't know if you saw that, if I included it or not. But I tried to like fast forward time and walk at the same time. Didn't work, by the way. I, I guess you can't do that. That was terrifying. <laughs> I was not prepared to deal with all that. I have like a beard. You're drowsy. Probably won't help much. But beer. There you go. That didn't do anything. Just toss it on the ground behind us as we go. It's just in the middle of the road. The symbol we've been here. We're like Hansel, Hansel and Gretel, or however you say it. Hansel and Gretel is how I say it. Um, except instead of like pebbles or breadcrumbs, we leave behind the empty beer cans. If we end up at the edge of the map, this is going to turn very survivor man in nature because it will take us forever, I feel like, to get back to anywhere close to civilization. If you look at, okay, sorry, if you look at a map, Project Zomboid, there are like just areas with just, just trees, just trees for miles and miles and miles in game. And it will take us forever to get through them if, <laughs> if we um, end up needing to travel through it. So, but we have a tent. That's cool. We have no food. We have the mystery berries. I'm sorry I misspoke. We have some water. We got that, a little bit of that and all that. We're actually doing pretty well in water. Not so well on food. So, like, I guess we could find some worms, probably. She's so tired. I'm sorry. I so wish something would come up. Like a house or a cabin. Anything. Just blank road. What if you could have a dog in this game? I think I've said that before, but that would be so cute. And heartbreaking, if anything could happen to them. 
I would like die for my dog in this game, I feel like. Something just popped up on my phone. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Like a bunch of things. Okay. Look. This is unfortunate, but I, I think I have to end it here because I don't know where we are. It's been like 40 minutes of my time. I'm still lost, so. I don't mean like in the series here. I just mean this particular video because I, I do have like a ton of notifications I should probably handle because some of them are related to my actual work. So <laughs> thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.